today's project, we're going to do two ginger bug mothers and one fermented ginger lemonade soda. Fermented ginger bugs are just amazing. They taste wonderful, but they're just packed full of B vitamins and probiotics and just all this good stuff for your gut. Um, it's just an amazing way to get, you know, all that wonderful stuff into your system. Today we're going to start with some, we're going to use lemon, ginger, and some water and sugar, and that's it. You need to have a couple of jars, um, mason jars probably would be best, and you need to start with very clean jars. Just uh, soap and water is good enough, and then we'll need to chop our ginger and get our sugar and our water ready and everything. We'll need two tablespoons ginger and one and a half cups water. We'll add uh, two and a half tablespoons of sugar as well. And this will get it fermenting really good. And you stir gently. I speeded this up the video so it looks like I'm stirring really hard but it's actually really really gentle and you cover it with a lid and that's pretty much it just store it in a warm place and in 24 hours we're gonna feed it um, and I'll, I'll tell you more on how to feed it at the end of this video but um, I made two so I'll sh yeah, I'll show you that at the end. And here's a finished bug that I've already made. Um, it's been fed for three days, and we're going to use that to make our, our lemonade. And like I said, the recipe is in the description below. Um, you're going to need lemons, water, and sugar to make the lemonade. And, of course, our, you know, our ginger bug, the finished ginger bug. And what I do here is I just slice some lemons and I add that to the jar and then I squeeze an entire lemon. So you can put as much lemon in here as you want. That's, you know, that doesn't really matter, but that's what I like. I like two lemons and this makes about three cups of our ginger lemonade. Um, of course you can make, you know, more, you can just double everything if you want. Um, but this you know, how I like to do it and, um, and you add two and a half cups of water and then what's going to bring it up to the three cups is we're going to add a half a cup of our finished uh, ginger bug to it Now, whenever you take away from your ginger bug, um, this half a cup that I drained out of there, um, I'm gonna, you know, pour that in here and that's gonna start the fermentation of the lemonade with the ginger. Um, we're gonna have to add back to our, you know, our mother ginger, ginger bug. Um, and here I'm adding one tablespoon sugar. You can add a little bit more if you like it a little bit sweeter, um, but I find this is, what I like um, you cover with a lid and in 24 hours you'll need to make sure that it's not like overly getting fizzy uh, you can try to burp it and see and you let it sit for five to seven days and just like I said burp is needed but you really want to leave that on there and just check it so that way you can get fizzy you know and it'll store for six months if it lasts that long and it doesn't around my house now like I said, we need to replace what we took out of the mother. So we're gonna add one tablespoon ginger back in to feed it. And then we're gonna add a half a cup of water and one this one tablespoon of sugar to feed it. Now 
Now this will go back in the cabinet and in 24 hours, you know, I'll need to feed it again and you'll just keep doing that. Now, if you're not using your ginger bug, you can put it in the refrigerator and, um, and then you don't have to, you can feed it just like once a week or something, but you need to, if you're going to use it, you need to bring it back out and start feeding it. Now here, um, at, you know, at the end, like I said, it's, Every 24 hours when you feed your ginger bug, what you're just gonna do is you're just gonna repeat the process. You can put one tablespoon of your ginger in there and one tablespoon sugar, and um, that's it. That's all you have to do. And this will get it really fermenting and feed it. And in like three days, you can go ahead and make something else. You could use, you know, cherry or strawberry or whatever you like um the lemonade's one of my favorite just absolutely love it but yeah that's it i hope you guys will make ginger bug and enjoy it it's just a great thing you can use it for all kinds of stuff salad dressings everything but thanks for watching be sure to like my video and subscribe to my channel and my links are all in you know in the description box below bye